So in this video, we'll explain how to set up a gyro kill switch if using the expert mode in the Aura. Um, if you do use the expert mode, you'll have three different flight modes, all of which have gyro gains associated with them. So therefore, there'll be no way to turn off the gyro if the need arises or if you wish to. In the manual here on page 21, it explains that you should do this by uh, using the wizard in the Aura config tool but that option is not actually there. So we'll explain how to do it. Okay, so now we need to connect our Aura to the computer. Say okay, and then read from Aura. The first thing you'll need to do is go to view and make sure the advanced view is selected. Under the flight modes, you'll be able to find out which control modes you're using. So here in flight mode one, we're using control mode B. It's just important to note this for the next step. In flight mode 2, we are using control mode C, and flight mode 3 is E. So just remember those. Then we go over into control modes and select the ones that we've just looked at. So the first one was B. So then if we scroll all the way to the bottom, this will now be visible because we've selected the advanced settings. Um, normally, this will be set to off by default. So you need to change it to on slash off and select an available channel, which will be anything above five, five being reserved for your flight modes. So I have selected six aux one, and you need to change that for all three of the axes. Once you've done that, you need to go ahead and do the same thing for C. So you can see I've already done that. And lastly, again, for E, the three flight modes that we have. This way we can turn the gyro off no matter which flight mode we're in. So we may wish to do that because we want to see how it performs without the gyro, or we've run into a situation where we think the gyro may be causing an issue and we want to be able to turn it off. Once you've done that, just be sure to write all to, all to Aura and you should be good to go. Hopefully this video was helpful. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching.